Good afternoon, brothers and sisters from Spiritual and Crooked Encounters. Uh, making this, this video to talk about uh, something that happened to me. Uh, it's been, I've been pretty busy, actually. That's why you haven't seen me post anything. Uh, I've been uh, busy with uh, a move to a different home. And also, I got married uh, this past weekend. But uh, what I want to talk to you all about is, is about something that happened uh, to me while I was making the move. You know, there was a lot of things happening spiritually, but I wasn't uh, too too much focused on the things that were happening spiritually. I just maintained a lot foundation. But something did happen. You know, I know if y'all know, but I collect minerals. I have a lot of minerals. I collect a lot of minerals, and I collect some of them for protection to protect my home. Um, my house is also blessed, uh, but the home that I was moving from, uh, it was two days ago, two days ago. It was around 8 o'clock, 8.30. It was a little bit dark outside, but not dark enough that you cannot see nothing. You could see the sky and everything. Well, as I was uh, loading uh, some items in the back of the vehicle, uh, I seen something up up on top of me, circling around me. And it was pretty big. It was massive. I wish I would have had my camera uh, or something on me to be able to record what I seen. Uh, but I didn't have it on me. Uh, there was this giant bat-like creature. This The wings were pretty massive. Uh, and it was circling around me in a circle. Uh, uh, I could see it up in the sky. Uh, that's how big it was that I could see it and it was pretty high uh, But I could still see it because it was that big and as it was circling around around me in a circle It was just circling around me. It started making this weird noise uh, It was like Making this noise that sounded to me sonic. Uh, it was weird. It was like ah, like sounded like a Like a yell or something some kind of yell, you know it wasn't a screech, it was a yell, like, ah, 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 it sounded real loud, you know, and and that's the way it sounded kind of like, like, ah, 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 you know, you could see the bat-like wings, it had the form of the bat-like wings, and it was just circling around me, and next thing you know, as I looked to the left, I seen two other ones that came with it. It came, it was calling, I believe it was calling those giant bat-like creatures. I don't know what it was, uh, but to me, the, it had the, the wings of the, the bats. Uh, they were massive. And they came with that one. They started, all three of them started circling around me. So as they were circling around me, you know, I was praying with myself. I didn't have fear, but uh, I was trying to figure out why they were there, you know, uh, why did they come to me or why to, to me seemed like they were tracking me or the other one calls them. So they were trying to do something. I don't know, but I started praying within myself. And as I was praying within myself, I called my, my wife, Maria to come outside. And as she was coming outside, this bad light creatures, they started taking off. So by the time she came outside, she only seen them from a distance, but she didn't get to see how big they were, how big, how giant they were. Uh, they were massive. Uh, if I could see them big in the sky, I could only imagine how big they would be close up. Uh, to me, you know, you know me, I'm a, a spiritual kind of guy, but what I've seen, they look, they were creatures. Now, whether, how, where they came from, you know, they were in threes. So spiritually, three to me could be demonic, right? Because they're, they're going in threes. I would see it as that, but I did see, see them in uh, the, the, this, the noise that it was making. It sounded kind of like a gorilla noise of a, of a sort. You know, like a gorilla noise, like, 
you know, like a, something like a gorilla, like a grunt of a gorilla. That's what it sounded like to me. But they were massive and they had these giant wings. Uh, there was a lot of uh, different things that happened uh, while I was trying to form a bond. You know, if, uh, when you form a, a bond with somebody and you get married, that's, that's made, uh, it's created out of love. I remember when I proposed to her, it froze. When we went to go file the pa paperwork to, to to get married, when we gave them a day, a date, there was a hailstorm that hit. On the day of the marriage, it rained. So then when I seen this bad light creatures, it's like a lot of things happened, brothers and sisters, that it, it felt like to me something was trying to interrupt the union, you know, which the union is out of love. But I seen these creatures, they were big. Uh, I would say they were as big as me, uh, as, as, as big as they were in the sky, and they were flying probably like, I would say, pretty high. I could see the, the big silhouettes. Uh, I couldn't imagine how big they were if they would have come down to the ground where I was at. See, and uh, another thing is next to me, uh, my neighbors, they have a cross in front of their house, a giant cross. And uh, it says, he has risen, right? We stop, was dealing with Jesus. And, and they have a, a baby that's like one year old. So when that happened, it was like I was trying to figure out, because I'm the one that's seen them. You know, the baby is innocent. The baby was inside the house. So right now I would like to pray. Uh, for their family, whether whatever it was made expressions known to whether to me, you know, me, I can see these things or whether it's out to do some, some harm or out to do something negative to, towards somebody, I'm going to pray. Heavenly Father, this time I'd like to pray for my neighbors at our old address for them to, for them and, the, and their child to be protected from any form of negativity. Uh, we place in heavenly crosses at their home, uh, heavenly crosses upon their, their child. So you can send your heavenly angels to protect that child from any kind of harm or any form of negativity. At the same time, I would like to place heavenly crosses in my home. Uh, protect me from any form of negativity as we interfere uh, of what I've seen as we interfere. We tie, bind, and rebuke these creatures, or whatever they may be. We tie, bind, and rebuke them in Jesus' name uh, for them not to be able to cause any harm or try to affect anybody in any kind of way. This I pray in your name. Amen. That's all for right now. That uh, this, I wanted to make this video uh, about this. Uh, I will share it in other live feeds. If somebody's commenting right now, I don't know who's here or not. Uh, probably everybody's busy working, but I, I felt I had to make this video uh, because it needed to be said. Uh, I believe we're in the midst, you know, I always say this, but I, we're in the midst of a, a, a spiritual battle, uh, a big spiritual battle. And it's about protecting the foundations. Uh, this negative energies they're going to use people that we know to come up against us we might use loved ones or ele the elements against us or creatures beings against us but that's okay uh so long you maintain a love foundation we can overcome any form of negativity with love because love will prevail uh will overcome any form of negativity. Yes, uh, this is this these creatures that I've seen, whether they be real or they come from the spiritual realm, they're they're pretty big, but I wasn't afraid of them. I maintain my love as I maintain the love that didn't get near me. Uh, but they were pretty massive. 
Uh, so I believe in the Bible, it says that in the latter years, that people are going to be able to hear, see, see things that spiritual gifts that we're going to be able to see this, these kind of things, uh, it's written in, within the Bible. And I believe, you know, it's here, uh, it's been here, it's been here for a long time. Uh, I wish, like I said, I had a camera or something to record the incident that happened. That's one of, one of my first, that's one of, I hadn't had an encounter with anything since I moved from uh, the clean area. Uh, I had an, had one encounter and I heard something on the trees, but I never looked what it was. But this is the first time it showed themselves to me. It was three of them, uh, three giant bat-like creatures. They had bat-like wings and they were making, they was making this weird noise, you know. I guess it was calling the other ones and when they came, they started circling around me. But I maintained my love and I rebuked them. And when I called upon my, my wife, they decided to take off. So, you know, whether it was real creatures, whether it was something out of the spiritual realm or shapeshifters, whatever, you know, so many, so many different theories that, that I could think of, you know, like I said, I, I was in the city. I mean, I was in, in the city. I wasn't out in the country or in the bushes. It came to me. You know, they came to me and that was kind of, I didn't want to say freaked out, but I was like, whoa, what's going on here? You know, and then when they started circling me, it's like, okay, because uh, the one that called them, he called the other two and they started circling me. It's like uh, they were fixing an attack or something like that. That's what it felt like to me, but I wasn't afraid of them. Uh, I know so long I can love in my heart and God on my side that I have nothing to worry about, nothing to fear. We will overcome and conquer anything that comes out of the spiritual realm in a negative way to cause harm. We'll tie, bind, and rebuke it in Jesus' name. That's all for right now, brothers and sisters. Uh, I just wanted to share this video of what happened to me two days ago. Uh, but I'm not giving it power. I believe that's what it wanted. For me to give it power in a sense of way to believe of what I've seen, and I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna believe that. I'm not gonna give it that power. I'm not gonna give it the power to, to try to, uh, or should I say, to grow. I'm not giving the power. I'm taking the power away because I'm taking authority over it. That's why Ty Bonnie rebuked it. Everybody have a beautiful, beautiful, blessed evening. God bless every one of y'all and your families. Peace.